Usually I start off with a face wipe. The Kirkland face wipes have been my all time fave. Look at all that. Why is there like a party in my bathroom? I mean, one of the good things about having three little cute girls, it's always interesting and fun and funny. <laughs> you know, we got a lot of tomatoes right now. I think we should pick them. Or you want me to pick them for the... I want to pick them too. You want to pick them? So how about this? I'll leave them for you to pick. Can you reach those ones? There you go. Look, Daddy, did the spider. I know. You just got to be careful. Here. Look at all those pictures. Hello. Let me hold it up. Why is it so oh. slowly? Why do you Daddy. Because that's not the kind of pepper it is. It's like a gong, a Thai gong pepper. Daddy, I don't know. Where's all the what? Ones? They're in the front. The um, red ones, they're all red. Yeah. They were all the same kind. So I'm sure you guys Daddy, have, have seen. This is pepper? about the size of my hand. Daddy. There is unfortunately a hole, but hopefully it'll still stay good. Good job, Juliana. Those are great. Scissors. Oh. <gasps> It's okay. Woo! I think it's a sweet Italian, or what is it called? Jolene's red Italian pepper. Mm. Good job, little one. That was a good one. Kira, Kira, look at it. Can I put this pepper on your, uh, in your bowl? Guess what? I found the jackpot of tomatoes. It's in the backyard. Let's go. Come on. Jackpot? No, I found it, didn't I? I found the jackpot, Daddy. You know what the jackpot is? This morning, before she even came out. Right here. Oh yeah, and we're gonna go ahead and pick them even though they're not quite ready. Wait, why like this. Think... Look through this plant and go ahead and pick all these ones that are about this red, okay? Oh my gosh! What? Daddy, come here. Look I it. know. Emerald's been eating I know. That one. We need to pick it. We'll Let's pick the other one. I think this oh, one Daddy, just... the emerald been eating this. Yeah, tomato. we'll we'll leave it. Uh, the these emerald's guys. been eating a strawberry too. No, it's okay. Just, it's okay, yeah. They want food. They want food. And we're gonna share because we've got plenty to share. And guess what? We're we're yesterday. Wait, wait, this one, Daddy. That's what a good I'm... one. This is what's unfortunate about having garden. Yeah. I'm waking my hands. You gotta share shirt. it with nature. I am waking my hands on your shirt, Daddy. Oh, yeah. To show mommy. Wow, mommy <laughs> go all crazy with all the tomatoes. Oh she is. <laughs> I was so tired last night. I just removed my face makeup, but I didn't bother with the eyes because it's too time consuming. Just trying to figure out what to eat. We have one tortilla left. I think I'll do a breakfast burrito. I'm just gonna do turkey. Oh, is this what I think it is? Just got home from working out. Oh! 
a whole box of crowbars. I'm totally going to break the rule right now. Are all these crowbars? Oh, yeah. No? All yeah. three boxes? No, no, no. Just my right. house is right here. See my Especially asked for this. My homie, Mark, mm -hmm. owns a donut shop Butter called the Donut Butter Factory. Butter Factory. Mm. It's a whole pack. Donut factory in the North Seattle area. Check it out. And if you guys live in Seattle, they have a second location now in the U District. This is one of my favorites, apple fritter. Okay, go ahead, grab it. What what kind is that, little one? Maple. Mmm, that's a good choice. There you go. All right, which one is yours? What is that? Is that a s'more? Hey, don't eat it yet because you guys got to eat lunch. I just wanted you to put it on there. Juliana, which one did you pick? Oh, we got something to eat. Go ahead. Okay, go ahead, get a plate and put it on there because I'm gonna cover this up. Mm. We're gonna give the rest to mom and papa, okay? Seriously, who doesn't love donuts? And these donuts are bomb, too. Oh, this is a Boston cream pie, also one of oh, our favorites. I already know what that is. That's red blue. velvet. Is it red velvet? Yeah, oh. red velvet. It looks like blueberry, but okay, yeah. Are these the ones? Kind of a sad day because our steamer broke. It broke down. This one we've had for, I think, a year and a half now, and it just broke down. I have no idea what happened. It just stopped working. I don't... Oh, it is kind of dirty. I don't know if this is even fixable. Like, okay, don't mind it. It's kind of, kind of dusty and dirty, but I wouldn't even know how to dissect this. I'm gonna clean it out and hopefully it'll work. Sounds like there's sand in here. I wasn't good about changing the water in here, so that could have played a big part. <laughs> then again, I wonder with these kind of products, like I read conspiracies somewhere where just like printers, they're just not meant to last long. After a certain amount of uses, it just shuts down so that you end up buying a new one. I wouldn't be surprised if this is like one of those things. So let's hook it back together. Nope. Didn't even flinch. I think it's completely out of commission. You know what sucks is that I don't think I even got a warranty for this. You would assume something like this would last at least two years. Okay, I'm tripping. I just checked online and I ordered this in July of 2016. So we've had it for a solid three years. It's not like I use it every day. I really didn't. I, I use it maybe at most one time a week. So it wasn't often. But crazy to think, you know what I'm saying? Like that conspiracy might be right. What if three years was a cutoff? I think it's something internal that's crazy. Okay, so I take it back. I had it longer than a year. <laughs> wow, see that's just, that just goes to show how much I didn't use it because I feel like it was still kind of new. As you guys know, Chris and I, we do live broadcasting in my crappy little tiny office back at home. It's 10 by 10, it's dinky. So Chris, and our friends David and Luria, and actually another Chris, have been working really hard to create the next space. Multiple screens and a huge big screen. Actually, I wanna give a shout out to TCL, because that is a TCL TV. It's actually really affordable for what you get. I'll be sitting right here. My guests will be right across the table. It's kind of like a dining room table chit chat session. We're gonna try to figure out what's gonna go on in the background. When I hear about them from different people, they always speak so highly of uh, them. And they actually helped us with Dan Samber too. David's sitting in right now for Chris. Say hi. Hello. <laughs> I'll put the link to their YouTube channel down below. You guys should definitely check them out. If you're interested in learning about, you know, best practice of, of uh, broadcasting and podcasting and that kind of stuff, go check out their channel. And we're so grateful because they also help um, with Dan Samber. So showing them some love. Thank you so much for setting this up for us because 
because it's pretty badass. And I think Ju Judy actually wants to come over here and do a podcast with me. Yeah, it, it actually was a lot of fun. And we appreciate you too, like hooking us up and, and, and the, the restaurants that you guys <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, they've been uh, hanging out in Seattle. I know that, Judy, you're excited because we might do a podcast together on this setup. I want to know from you what topics you want us to cover on the podcast. If Judy and I did a podcast, go ahead and put it in the comments area because Judy and I thought it'd be fun just to do one at first and see where it goes. For Judy, we put the better equipment on her side. Of the nice, day. nice. That was a good call, honey. You heard it. So that means you have to come here and record something with me. I'm cleaning out the guest bedroom closet and I found a box of the kids' old toys. It's so random that it's in here. Oh, this is like little kid toys. How long has it been in here? What? Is it a room? Watch. The kids are going to play with this like they're brand new. Yeah, we're lying. Oh, this has been here for like two years. It's you know, with my memory, it could have been four years. Mm. Where is this from? Is this one from Rapunzel? Yeah. Slide it. Don't carry it. Can you open the door for me? Sure. Okay guys, let's go. They've been playing with those toys the last two hours. I love when they rediscover their old toys. It's awesome. Oh no, oh no. <gasps> I need to put cream on that ASAP. Benji and I just have a quick meeting. I'm gonna drop off the kids to my parents. And then, Benji's leaving. There's way too many. I guess we'll be eating donuts for breakfast in the next few days. Yes. No, we're gonna give more of these to mom and dad. No, if you can't hold it, you're not bringing it. I can do this. Okay, let's go. Here, wait, what's going on here? But you have to bring the car? Yep, I'm bringing the car. Okay, if you could carry it. I did say if you could carry it, you could bring it. Wait, I have to go potty first. Dude, the sit, oh my gosh. What time is your flight? 11.30. Oh yeah. Oh snap, but you still have to go because. <laughs> starting to pack now, that's right. Not sure if you want to be proud of that. Oh my gosh, he's going, going to. You're gonna mention it. Yeah, he has a wedding rehearsal in about an hour. And he's just now back. And then from there, he's gonna leave us. We're gonna miss you. Just for a hot second. Mm-hmm, then vacay. Then vacay, which. That's gonna be a nice slowdown for all of us. Mm -hmm. Red eye flight. So it means I'm gonna go to sleep. I'm gonna give my skin a break tomorrow. I'm not gonna put any foundation on. Let's just do an updated skincare routine. Usually I start off with a face wipe. The Kirkland face wipes have been my all-time fave. I just kind of go over and remove most of the makeup. Voila. Look at all that. And then depending on how I'm feeling, I'll use either cleanser, the Clinique, take the day off cleansing oil or the Olay Regenerous Cleansing Cream Cleanser. I always thought this was kind of a scrub because they have really tiny gentle beads in here. Yeah, gentle exfoliators. So today I'm gonna use the Clinique Take the Day Off. And then after that, I'll use a toner. Ultimately, I know this isn't the best for your skin. It's Escanol, it's like the classic Philippine cleanser. <laughs> Literally the second ingredient is alcohol. It's water and then alcohol. But there's something about that invigorating like cleanse feeling that I really like. Or I'll use one of the Pixie, either the Glow Tonic, which this is my second giant size. Or lately I've been using the Retinol Tonic, which I really like this as well. Today I'm gonna use good old Escanol, and maybe it's because of my zit. 
there's still dirt, not much, but there's still dirt on there. I received this Biosance a while ago in a PR package. Squalane and Vitamin C Rose Oil. I love the scent of rose. So I just put this on my skin. I don't like how shiny it leaves me. <laughs> But I know that this is nourishing my skin and it's good for my skin, especially as I'm aging. So I really lather it in. I use Olay's Deep Hydrating Gel. I typically put this on before the oil, but what else? I got my zit cream or drying lotion. I can't even tell, like, how it looks like there's 10 of them in one spot. All done. It's just Juliana and I tonight because the twinsies are sleeping at mama and papa's. And daddy is... Daddy's on a plane. He's actually hopping on a plane now. What? It's 11. Yeah, I think he's actually on the plane. We're the going fair. to Woo. the fair Evergreen tomorrow. Fair. And we're going to... Yeah, the Evergreen Fair. So stay tuned for tomorrow. Thumbs up if you made it this far and you enjoy the vlog. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Night night. Mm, night night. I don't care. Yeah. This is my favorite. Here, this could be a shirt for your shopping. Guys, I found this. We have a little teacup.